everybody, Thor with Alpaca here. Gonna show you the new HD skirt. We're super excited about this skirt. We've been working on it with the Valkyrie project. Taking us a little bit longer to release it, but we're really happy with the final product. We've got uh, a neoprene tunnel that's sized, and there's a sizing chart. This is just like a whitewater kayak skirt. Got a heavy duty nylon deck. And then we've got these neoprene corners that have the elastic on them to fit this over your deck. Um, this new skirt is a lot drier, it's a lot more secure, and it's a lot more durable than the ultralight skirt. It is a little bit harder to put on and a little bit harder to take off. That's part of being more retentive. So if you find your current lightweight skirt uh, just enough, uh, you don't need to upgrade to this. But if you wanna run a little bit harder white water, having trouble with your skirts, uh, wearing out too fast or imploding on you, this is a really nice big upgrade. So the real key quirk on this skirt or the real key trick on this skirt is how you remove it. Putting it on is simple. Start at the back, just like a whitewater kayak skirt. Put the front on and then work the sides on. It's pretty straightforward, fairly easy to get on. It is a little bit tight. It gets a bit looser once it's wet, but it's fairly straightforward to put on. When you're taking it off, if that's a wet exit, meaning you're upside down and you need to get out of the boat, it's no problem. You can grab the handle, you can just pop right out. The skirt will come right off. We've never had any trouble with that. But when you're doing a controlled exit, so you're paddling into an eddy and you're just getting out, there's a temptation, because this is what you do with a whitewater kayak, to come up and grab the handle to remove the skirt. And a lot of people, when they do that, pull this handle pretty slowly. And if you pull it slowly, you can already see, you're gonna bend your combing, that's the rim, back pretty hard and in some cases you can actually crimp the combing which will compromise it and you'll need to move that crimp to the side and eventually replace it. So we're going to ask you not to do that to kind of protect your combing. The handle is there for wet exits and then we kept it in the same place because that's where it's at in a kayak and we're not going to change people's sort of perceptions when they're upside down. But in a controlled environment it's much better to come over, grab the neoprene, and pull this deck skirt off from the side. You'll never hurt your combing do they, doing that. It actually comes off a lot easier and a lot nicer. So again, putting it on, throw it on like this, go over the top, taking it off, grab the neoprene and pull it off from the side and that'll, that'll save your combing in the long run. If you forget and you do happen to grab the handle to pull this skirt off, it's much better to pull hard and fast than long and slow. So if you really must do it this way or forget, pull it hard and you'll keep your combing intact. But I still want to reiterate, much better to remove the skirt from the neoprene right here. It comes right off, super easy to do, and you'll protect your combing in the long run. Um, that's all I've got for you. If you got any other questions about this skirt, please reach out and we'll do our best to answer them.